Welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing as well as trying out and reviewing this new action camera that I got a while back. This is the Akoso 4K action camera. This is the EK7000. I really went ahead to open these up and I'm just going to play around with it. I want to see if this could be a potential vlogging camera and startup camera for beginner YouTubers or people who just want that very minimal very discreet camera to vlog with so let me just go ahead to open this up so the first box that I'm seeing right now is the actual camera and this is what it looks like right here it is so tiny and this is what you get this is the waterproof case so let me just open this up this is how it is done yep so we can definitely open it up to get the actual camera this is what it looks like right here it is so tiny oh my goodness let me put this against my vlogging camera this is my vlogging camera and this is the Acoso one it is literally like one fourth the size it is so tiny but at this point it is less about the size and more about the quality especially now in 2020 this says it can record in 4k which is a good thing but i i do want to test the 4k quality and capability but before we do that let's just read some of the claims and see what is also included in this box it has a 170 degree lens so you kind of have like that 170 angle of view it is waterproof it goes up to 98 feet and that is what i like about this action camera is that you can use this for anything action related underwater skydiving jumping and it is very inexpensive i got this for 49 dollars basically 50 dollars so inside this we also have some accessories here as well uh let me just open this up and wow we have quite quite a lot let's just see oh wow i wow this is actually a lot i'm guessing this probably would be all you would need to get you started with creating um amazing content and setting up so we have another case right so you can use this instead of using this but this one is specifically for underwater so i'm gonna quickly just set this camera up let me turn it on this is so weird let me take this out i'm really interested in testing out the audio quality as well as the visual quality so i'm just looking at it on the screen right here guys <laughs> the quality looks terrible <laughs> i can't even lie the quality looks terrible i went ahead to set it and i set it to 4k um hopefully it's not as bad as it looks hopefully I can blame the quality on maybe the display, the LCD, but it looks terrible. Okay, so this is what it looks like here. We have one button here. I think we have about four buttons. This one to turn it on, this one to start recording, and this to change the dials up and down. It's pretty much basic. Um, let me turn this on. You guys can see oh it's on already okay so this is what it looks like from now you guys can probably see that the angle is pretty wide the angle is pretty wide and it kind of looks hideous but I do want to clean the lens first of all do so what I'm going to do right now is to just test the audio quality I feel like I should mount this up to a tripod but I'm not gonna do that right now I just want to give like a first impression and test this out with like my studio lighting and then maybe go outdoor to the balcony and set this as well. So I'm going to press record right here. Hopefully it's recording. Is it recording? Okay, yeah, it's recording. So, hey guys, so this is me testing the Aka So Action camera. This is the EK7000. I'm just trying to figure out what this looks like and sounds like. I'm not sure where the audio or the microphone is so i'm hoping that i'm not blocking it or anything i'm also hoping that i'm in frame because i cannot see myself i'm just you know creating and hoping that this turns out 
looking good. I'm moving around to kind of see what this looks like whenever I'm changing my lighting and direction and all of that. This is what we're looking like. What is it feel of you? What does it look like? What does the quality look like? Is it good? Is it any good? Can we manage it? If not, let us know down in the comment section. Now, this is what it looks like in my studio. I'm going to compare this against my normal DSLR camera. And you guys can probably see that you it's unmatched because this is a DSLR camera. This is heavy duty camera. This is on the go fast content creation. What we're trying to see is if this can measure up with your mobile phone or even a compact vlogging camera like this one. This is a Sony ZV1. This is probably the most, I wanna say budget friendly, but still like the best vlogging camera out there for now in 2020. So what I want to do right now is to kind of um, record on my normal DSLR camera, record on this action camera, but also record on my compact camera. I wanna see, the quality i want to be able to compare the quality against each other kind of see what they look like turn around a bit to measure up in terms of quality yeah guys this is a side-by-side -side comparison between my sony zv1 my akaso ek 7000 4k action camera and lastly my canon m6 mark ii camera paired up with my sigma 30 mm 1.4 lens this is what the quality looks like let me know which one you prefer but i do want to do like a side by side comparison between the akaso ek 7000 against my sony zv1 just so you guys can see because now we're dealing with like compact on the go vlogging cameras and yeah let me know what you guys think down as well but yeah um i definitely think that this is definitely something you can you know invest in definitely be on the lookout for more vlogging cameras relating to like action cameras i'm gonna stop this comparison right here now because now i want to go outdoor i want to use the natural lighting to test what the quality looks like so i'm gonna step out in my um i want to use the natural lighting let me know what you guys think about this i am in lagos nigeria and it's pretty noisy i can even hear the generator noise from here but i want to know what the audio sounds like i want to know the quality of this when i'm vlogging with like my natural lighting and natural environment what does the audio look like what does the visual look like let me know down in the comment section let me just go down a bit i'm going to tilt a little bit just to see how well the lighting setting is the ISO, the aperture, what this looks like in different lighting scenarios. Let me back the light. This might be cringy. Is the visual good? Is it like my I can't even open my face because of how bright the sun is. But I do want to know what this looks like on the camera. Again, turning around just to see how well this responds to different lighting scenarios. Can you guys hear me? Do I need to scream before you hear me? If I do, then there's no sense, there's no point in having this compact camera. Let me know what the quality is like at the same time. I'll see you guys down in the comment section. Hey guys, so that is what the quality looks like coming out of this action camera. This is my first time trying out an action camera. Um, I'm kind of eager to see and to kind of play around with the actual, the best vlogging, um, the I'm kind of eager to try out the GoPro just to see what the quality is like and maybe even compare it with this but I don't know if that's going to be worth it let me know down in the description box let me know but I don't even know if that is actually going to be worth it so let me know down in the comment section if you guys own one if you've tried one before what is it like is it life-changing um, I don't know what the quality is like until i actually start editing this video hopefully i'm gonna update you guys on it later on but what are your thoughts i'm very curious to know because at the end of the day you guys are the viewers you are the ones consuming my content and you guys kind of determine um if it's good enough or if it's not good enough so i do want to know from you i do want to hear from you what are your thoughts is it good enough 
I don't want to hear from you. So what are your thoughts? Is this a good investment? Is it worth it? Let me know down in the description. Let me know down in the comment section and I'll be more than happy to kind of interact with you down there. Again, this is the Akaso EK4. Again, this is the Akaso EK7000 action camera. It is 4K, but again, the 4K might not be able to measure up with the 4K of a normal DSLR camera. But let me know down in the description box. Personally, for me, to be honest with you, I think I think I, I still prefer my mobile phone because my mobile phone shoots not only 4K but also 8K content. And yeah, I 100% always recommend filming on your mobile phone. But again, because I'm someone who is so into tech and trying out new cameras and devices. This is definitely something to definitely look into if you want to go underwater, you want to skydive, you want to ride bicycle, but you're scared of putting your camera, you're scared of putting your actual camera or your mobile phone in such a compromisable and maybe even dangerous situation. So this could be something to figure out. I feel like with this, if you're in Lagos, you can definitely hold you can even vlog with people not knowing you're vlogging you can put this in your pocket and you can vlog and people wouldn't know that you're vlogging as opposed to holding this or like dslr camera this one would be good for like pranks and behind the scenes and all that surveillance and whatsoever so yeah um it's just my thoughts on it if you want to swing skydiving you want to create underwater content you want to do stunts definitely don't do that with your dslr camera or your compact camera that are expensive or even your mobile phone definitely play around with this 50 dollars and you can create crazy content so yeah that's what this one is for for swimming for traveling for skydiving anything that is too dangerous to <laughs> play around with my phone or my actual compact camera i can't wait to edit this video let me know what you guys thoughts are down in the comment section and yeah in case you guys are new here and you like tech related videos blogging camera my setup filming camera lenses audio whatever you are into i got you because i am most likely into that as well i will leave links to that as well as my entire playlist over here and over here at the same time so whichever one you prefer whichever one you're feeling whatever mood you're in i got you so check them out let me know what your thoughts are down in this comment section and i can't wait to see you guys in my next videos don't forget to subscribe because it is free i'll see you guys in one of these videos till then stay fabulous and stay blessed bye guys <laughs>